Hey guys. So, I check my voicemail from time to time because if I um, have anybody blocked, apparently they can still leave a voicemail. So, I had noticed a handful of voicemails from my mom. Uh, but they're all the same. They're exactly the same. It's, hi, and I'm not going to put my name. I'm going to actually cut that part out where she says it, my name. And then it'll say, this is your mother. Remember me? And then it's always, you know, this is my new cell phone number or whatever. And it's, you know, the same old. So I kind of deleted all those because they were kind of redundant. And it's almost as if she forgot she called me. I don't know what's going on. But then the last one I saved, and I wanted to play it for you guys, because I just, you know, this is why I don't call, because they don't, her or my sisters don't think they're in the wrong in any given way, that they've done, any, that they're bad people. They just think, I'm the weirdo, I'm the crazy one, maybe I'll come around, and when I, if, when, <laughs> in, their, in their eyes, when I do, I owe them an apology. So just by this voicemail alone, you can see exactly what I'm talking about. So enjoy. Does your mother remember me? I'm still around and I still think of you. I don't know why you're not talking to me. This is stupid, really stupid. Uh, you get nothing to, you gain nothing from that. Uh, only a bad name for yourself. Uh, I'd like to speak to one of the girls if I can. Uh, Miss Zoe will answer me. Uh, I don't understand that. All right. Be that way. Bye. All right, guys. So, what did you think? If you want to comment down below, appreciate it. Have you ever gotten awesome voicemails such as that? Uh, I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, it's. I can't imagine calling her back, like the conversation, how that, how that would go, you know, it would just be, I don't understand why you don't call me. I am your mother. And you know, I am a mother myself. I don't like to even say mother, so it creeps me out. I don't expect my kids to put me on some pedestal. Like, I don't believe in respect your elders if your elders are a-holes to you. Like, I'm sorry, but I wouldn't expect my kids to respect me either if I treated them like that. So... No. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for listening. And uh, yeah, if you have a story to uh, share, definitely comment down below. Talk to you later. Bye.